ABC 24 is also on weather watch this Friday morning, getting you ready for snow. More snow at that. Like I have seen snow beginning of March, but it is almost mm. mid March. Charles, is this normal? It actually is probably more normal than you think it is. Really? Yeah. So when we look at some of our historical records, some of our uh, biggest snows are actually uh, in the top 10. March 17th and 1892, that's 18 inches. Now over a span of three days, a mom has told me about this one in 68, 17.3 inches, 9 inches in 1875 on the 7th. Now, most recently we did see three and a half inches in 2015. The latest in March that we saw it was March 30th in 1906, but the absolute latest on record that Memphis has ever had snow was April. Uh, I believe it was about the 6th or 7th in 1971. So this is not uncommon. This is actually fairly normal. On top of that, we talk about freezes. The earliest freeze we've ever seen is February 12th. The average is March 19th, and we're getting close to that. And thankfully, by the 19th, we'll be nice and warm. The latest was April 25th. So yeah, no, this is pretty normal to go from these extreme highs to extreme lows and for snow. So again, uh, we're not expecting a, a big event, a record event or anything by that stretch, but it is enough to put us all under a winter weather advisory, as you can see, for the entire Mid-South through tomorrow morning. We are looking at most of us about an inch up to three, possibly even four for some very isolated areas. Uh, so again, most of that is going to be on elevated surfaces because it has been so warm over the past several days. Now it can be a little bit treacherous as far as trying to drive through all of this. So I'm going to break down the hour by hour when you can expect the actual movement of the system, the accumulation, who would be likely to see the most and uh, how long it should stick around. So I've got that and more all coming up in your forecast. John.